Hey, what's up and hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Kennedy and over here we like to go thrifting. So that's exactly what we're doing today. Um, I drop a new video once a week, sometimes twice a week, depending on how crazy I'm feeling that week. <laughs> um, but today, like the title says, we are going thrifting and I don't normally get to go to this thrift store. What? There is a spider in my car. Oh my god, ew. Okay, like I was saying, that was disgusting. Um, I don't get to go to this uh, store very often because it's a cute little black owned family thrift store, which I love, but they are very like, <laughs> I don't know very family oriented I guess it's not even like a bad thing that I was about to say but they're only open from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. every day well Monday through Saturday and normally I'm working or sleeping on a Saturday and just not up in Adam I guess um, but I have not gone thrifting yet, yet this week it is actually Saturday and I was up at 9 a.m. so we're headed there now um, I am gonna be 30 minutes late, but honestly, it's cute. It's a little place. They always have really great deals So I'm excited to see what we can find in there. It's been probably like four months since I've last been um, So yeah, let's go support them and see what we can find today The parking lot is full y'all the parking lot is full. I repeat. This is not a drill. I got to go right now Okay, these are kind of cute. I'm loving this like salmon color, little kitten heel. Just saw this um, like really cute like crochet little sack bag. Um, yeah, the sack. So I'm gonna grab this. I also saw these pants and it already has that like, everyone's doing that little shoestring trend. This one already has that like built in, so. Perfect. I just found this wicked little baby tee, and then this actually goes perfectly well with it. Um, but it's like a mesh, just like super funky button down. So I'm gonna add these to the cart. This skirt is so cute, like has a little asymmetrical moment at the bottom, but it is just missing so many of the little rhinestones. I'm gonna have to leave it and I hate that. And it's like plus size, that would have been so cute. Damn, I saw this peeking out, guys. Like no way, it's perfect. Yeah, mm hmm in the cart. I also don't know what it is about silhouettes like this, but I always gravitate towards them. Like, Dress Barn was really that girl. Just found this gym in the kids section. Their stores are funny because why did I find this shirt <laughs> right next to this shirt? <laughs> like, <laughs> this is supposed to be kids shirts. What is nasty women vote? Like period, but like what is that doing next to the shirt? Please answer quickly. You really have to check all the sections because why did I just find that amazing piece hidden in the kids' t-shirts? Are you kidding? That's, no. <laughs> this is like so serious. A family reunion shirt, but I kind of want it. I think it's, I think it's the color. And the fact that it has like a Texas on it and I'm from Texas. But I might be posing like I'm from another family. Like I really might. I don't know. I just found an artifact. No. Who <laughs> remembers it? I used to love this guy. Holy crap. Talk about my childhood. I have to get this just on principle alone. Add to cart immediately. Add to freaking cart. 
guys. <laughs> just when I thought this trip couldn't get any better, um, the owner just came up to me and she was like, baby, go get you a bag. And I'm like, what are you talking about? And she was like, go get you a bag up front. Fill it up with as many clothes as you can. And the whole bag is $10. I about fell to the ground. Dramatic as hell, but I about fell to the ground. She's like, each one of those pieces are gonna be like a dollar, two dollars, which hindsight is already a really great deal. Um, but she's like, everything you can fit in that bag, ten dollars. I have a whole cart. <laughs> I'm about to walk out of here, only spend like twenty dollars on like fifty things. I used to do fill bags all the time in Houston, and I am a pro at this. So I'm very excited and <laughs> I've got to get over here more to support them. They are just so awesome. Um, she's running around um, like making sure everything's good. One of her kids is at the cash register. The vibes are just amazing in here. Oh my god. I love supporting small businesses, especially when I can give back to the black ones. Uh, I'm just so happy. I, you can't see it. Well, you might be able to see it. I'm teasing so hard underneath this mask, so I'm about to go get my brown bags and fill them up, <laughs> and uh, then we'll get out of here and do a haul. <laughs> I was putting down my putback file, and look what I found. Yup, thank you. I'm sweating so bad in here. Help. Another one that bites the dust. I was gonna get this. I was very excited to get this. I mean, just look at it. No explanation needed. But unfortunately, it has a rip in it and it's missing some buttons. I was only gonna get this to resell it. Um, but it's like a plus size, so it's obviously not gonna fit me. If it was gonna fit me, and it was like my size, I would get it and alter it and put in the money because I think it's absolutely worth it. But to resell it, I would have to like mark it down so much. It just wouldn't make sense. So unfortunately we are gonna leave it here, but I do want to document how gorgeous she was. Um, let's see what brand she is in case you wanna find it. Yeah, it's a shame. I was on my way to put these back because they're size 11 and that is a hard size to sell. And then I turn around and look at these. Look, look. Oh my God, I'm getting these. Ugh, come on. Making a mess. Oh yes, getting. Okay, but also honorable mention these. Again, size 11. Ugh, I don't know who had big feet, but they had a lot of style. <laughs> okay, but they must have put some new stuff out while I was shopping. You're also coming with me. These are also a size 11. Icon. All right, let's go check out before I spend any more. Not that I'm spending a lot because fill bag, but still. And just like that, we are out of there. Only the clothes were full of bag. So it was $10 for this huge bag of clothes. And then I got the two shoes and that purse. And so um, those were $5 all together. Prices are unbeatable. Um, <laughs> So, oh, that the sun is bright. So I spent a total of $15 on all of this. Guys, support the small businesses. I can't, ex oh my God, I can't say it enough. Something in me is telling me to do this haul outside. So here we are underneath the tree doing this haul outside. So we're gonna start off with the, there's a bee. Okay, we're gonna start off. Um, with the shoes and those purses or the purse I got so the first thing are these shoes they're baby pink color um, I really just got them because of that butterfly on the front and they're like a cute little kitten heel they're by Jay Vincent also I got these kitten heels um, I don't know they were just super cute so here we go okay so next is this crochet bag it's by a brand called The Sack. Um, it's got the little buckles on the side. Pretty decent size. 
perfect for summer. So before we get into the clothes, let's just take a guess. You guys saw the cart. You see the bag, it's absolutely filled to the brim. How many items do you think I got in this bag? Pause the video, let me know down below. My guess is 25. And I'm sticking with that. All right, so the first piece out of the bag is this Bart Simpson one. And then, of course, I had to get this. I told you guys I was the crazy frog tea. This is just like a size too big, but I'm hoping I can get it altered. It's a little halter crochet dress. It's vintage. The color. <gasps> and I know I said I always gravitate toward gravitate towards these and i'm not sure if i was gonna get it but i ended up getting it because it was filled bag and it fit in my bag so got that dress and then i got this like whimsy goth kind of skirt there's a close-up like on the print maxi length and it is plus size so these are for my plus size girly this is for my plus size girlies and then I think I already showed you this t-shirt and here's the back I just like love these like grungy baby tees every time I see them I just have to pick them up and then I found this maxi skirt got like a little lettuce hem at the bottom and then I found this cold shoulder top that's what people call them I guess um, the shoulders like out open oh this is supposed to be tied on the side but right now I guess the sleeves are just flying free but I swear it's cute just use your imagination <laughs> and then on that same like vibe I guess we have this one, very boho, like, have the, um, what are these called? Trumpet sleeves or bell sleeves? I'm not sure. I always get those mixed up, but there's that. And then I was super excited to find this. I don't know why, but <laughs> just look at it. It's so country. <laughs> uh, it's a little too big for me, unfortunately. It is a large. Um, the brand is Jessica Max. She always has like the craziest little montage like prints on her shirts. And I always pick these up when I find them. And then I also found this baby tee. Again, on that kind of like boho hippie vibe. Maybe fairy? I'm not really sure. Um, but here's this shirt. Of course, this vest I showed earlier that I found in the kids section, hidden away, icon. Then we had this Tommy tank. And then the shoelace shorts. Of course, the Wicked Baby Tee I showed earlier. To match with that, of course, this is that like mesh button up situation. These tops are always great for summer and layering because they are like very lightweight, see through, but it like allows you to have that layered look without burning the hell up. <laughs> you guys better not make fun of me in the comments over this. But remember when I showed you guys that like family reunion baby tea? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I'm now a member of the, what family is this? I should know my own family. Stallworth, I guess? I don't know. But I'm now part of the fam. <laughs> 
And then I also found this like mock turtleneck velour um, like tank top, animal print. And then I also found this if it would open. I also found this just like beaded cami kind of tank top. How many, how many are we at at this point? I feel like we're over 20. Stuff is like falling in my head. The icon, the legend, the absolute moment how to get this tea. I mean, tank. This shirt that I caved and ended up getting, I think I'm just gonna crop it. I just love cow. <laughs> I just loved how cow looked on here. And I do love Chick-fil-A, I'm not gonna lie, so it's whatever. I got it. Also got my Twilight Donate Blood shirt. I really did used to donate blood all the time in high school to get the t-shirts, but I never got this one. So I feel like I put in enough blood, enough time, enough effort to deserve this. <laughs> I also found, I don't think I showed these earlier. <laughs> these would unroll. Okay, I also found these like pinstripe pants. They're black, white, and pink, and they're kind of a wide leg. So very excited about those. We're almost to the bottom, guys. Okay. This was a crazy, one of my craziest finds today. Honestly, it might be the craziest. Okay, so look, cute, right? It's a maxi skirt. Well, more like a midi. We'll say that, it's a midi skirt, okay? And I was like, oh, cute. But wait. It's a two in one. And look, the print pops out at the bottom. Are you kidding, two in one skirt? talk about sustainable fashion two skirts in one doesn't get better than that okay just a few things left i found this like soccer is life cut off it's vintage um it kind of i don't know it reminded me of like um like posters at like the scholastic book fair in school i don't know if you guys are old enough to have those if they still have them at all but something about it, it was so nostalgic, so I had to grab it. I also got this shirt, it just says love, but it's for the people. Love is love, my alphabet mafia. <laughs> All right, two more things. The first piece is just this white button up. I have one, but it's getting a little dingy, so it's time to get a new one. This one's gonna be a little bit more oversized on me because I did get it in the men's department and I did get a size up than my normal size. So yeah. And then the absolute last piece I got was, what is it? Oh, this is a little embarrassing to end on, but <laughs> this Bass Pro Shops like t-shirt. I don't know, it's vintage and i was just really vibing with it i have like four of these i've now started to collect them i think it's because i'm in alabama i don't know what it is i'm slightly embarrassed but it is what it is um that was the last thing i did not count so we're gonna count as i put them back in the bag all right so one two three <laughs> Seven, twenty-eight. I was pretty close. I said twenty-five, and I stuck beside her. Um, but it was twenty-eight, so that's honestly really good. Twenty-eight pieces, ten dollars. Do the math. Whatever that is, I'll put it on screen. 
it doesn't get much better than that um that's it comment down below your favorite piece um <sighs> what else i don't know like the video subscribe share with your friends and i will see you guys in the next video peace